morning, my friends. Um, about to leave for work, but I wanted to show you really quick what I've got going on. I was cleaning out my freezer and organizing it and I found a package of ground beef from the grocery store, so I better cook that. So well, I'll just cook it off in my slow cooker and uh, refreeze it once it's cooked for something else. And I thought, no, I think we're just gonna eat it because I don't have anything prepared for dinner today. So let me show you what I'm gonna do. I'm going to make a made right sandwich. Have you heard of those? Now that's not from my region. Um, different area that they uh, do the made right sandwiches but the delicious so they're great for like game day a lazy Sunday throw this in your slow cooker and you've got a, a meal ready so here's the difference my burger is froze not a big deal I'm not a worrier so here's what we're gonna do now if if you have uh, unfroze ground beef definitely use that mine's frozen so I'm working with what I got folks so, inside my little uh, slow cooker here, I have two pounds of uh, ground beef. Now, I've had it on for a little bit. I found a little bit of frozen onion. Threw them in there, too. So, um, it's like I said, it's still froze. It's going to do its magic while we're at work. Uh, we'll be home by 1.30 at the latest and to have our lunch before we go back for evening shift. So, inside of here, I have a half a cup of hot water and I dissolved one beef bouillon and one chicken bouillon. You probably got all of this stuff in your fridge and pantry. We don't have the chicken or the beef, use one or the other. It doesn't matter. It's not a big deal. Okay, so to that, I'll move this over here to the side so you can see what I'm doing. It's one tablespoon of everything. So we're gonna do one tablespoon of brown sugar. Mix that in there. one tablespoon of soy sauce you might hear jake he's very interested in what i'm doing he smells that ground beef not for you sir one tablespoon of worcestershire i know jakey it smells good and one tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. And I'm making a mess. Ooh, got a little extra in there. So when I was growing up, my favorite thing in the whole world was when my dad would fry uh, ground beef for spaghetti. And um, he would have that ground beef and those onions cooking in the skillet. And once it was done, he would scoop a little out, put it on a piece of white bread and fold it over and give it to me. Oh, it was just heaven. I love a good sandwich. You're gonna stir all of those ingredients up. You're gonna pour it right over that ground beef. And like I said, I had onion in there, so you'll definitely wanna put some onion in there. I just had some frozen onion, and um, my beef's already starting to thaw out since I've had it in there. That's it, we're gonna put it back. I've got it on high since I am, it's frozen and I'm getting ready to leave for work. So when I get home from work in a little bit, I'll show you what it looks like and we'll have our sandwiches. Have a good morning, guys. And my clicker doesn't want to work. Hey, friends. It's, I'm back home. It's about 1.30. Um, Thursdays are always super busy. That's when our food delivery truck comes and then our normal lunch shift. So I was happy to have lunch made for me when I came in this morning, this afternoon. It smelled so good when I walked in the house. So here it is. My uh, slow cooker did the work for me. Now listen, it doesn't look like much because, you know, it's a loose meat. But the smell is delicious. I wish you could smell that. Now there's that. I'm going to add American cheese to mine. You can add whatever you want. It's your sandwich. Mustard, ketchup, mayonnaise. I know a lot of the purest... Uh, where this originate from just swears by the meat only. So maybe they could chime in and tell me um, if they've had a made right and what they put on it. So there it is. Delicious. I hope I made it right. Boom, 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 boom. So anyway, I'm going to go and, and enjoy this delicious sandwich for my lunch before I have to go back to work. So have a great day. Hope this is something that uh, you might like to make and try. Bye, guys. Have a good day.